Hello, Glenn Walton here from English Pro Soccer and FC Jersey Soccer Academy. I'm here down in Lindhurst, New Jersey today, where I'm working with a U11 girls team. Uh, we're running through the last practice of the season, so we're going to be running through some dynamic shooting drills. I'm just going to turn around and show you the setup. So the setup with the drills here, we have three grids. Grid 1, Grid 2, and Grid 3. Now I'll show you later what we can do in the exercises, but for the setup in grid one, you can have one goalkeeper in the goal. If you have more than one, you can rotate the goalies around. The players will start at the, at the green cone here and will attack the middle orange cone at pace. Any move, any turn at the cone must be followed by a one touch shot after you pass the cone. Three minutes on each section, players will rotate and rotate their own scores. Over here in grid two, we have a lane with yellow pennies across the center of the grid. Once again, there's a goal at the bottom which a goalie will be in. Over here, the player will play with their back to goal in front of the yellow pennies, which is simulating the back four or the line of defense. The player will stay in line with the back four or the line of defense. Ball will be played into the player's feet. On the half turn, they must turn without touching one of the yellow markers. Get a one touch shot. Once again, scores are recorded, goalkeepers are rotated. Over here in the final grid, this is grid three, this is a breakaway grid, where players will take on the goalkeeper one versus one. The coach will be serving the ball in with the start marker. It will start with the coach dropping the ball over the player's head. The player has four seconds to get the ball out of feet and finish before the time runs out. Once again, scores are recorded. Over all three sections of the shooting drill, players will record one point per goal. There is also a reward for goalkeepers, one point for each save. And once goalkeepers come out and play strikers, goals and saves will be added or subtracted to give you a final score. When the kids arrive at the session later, I'll be putting them through a quick warm-up. Then I will video the shooting session. Over and out.